Now we will calculate moments of two parameter Laplace distribution. Firstly, we will calculate rth moment about region. Then from this relation, we will calculate all the other moments about origin. Firstly, x is a random variable which belongs to two parameter Laplace distribution with these two parameters. Now, we will calculate rth moment about mean which is equals to expectation of x raised to power r. Now, according to the definition of expectation, we get integration over the whole values of x. That means in two parameter Laplace distribution, our x lie between minus infinity to infinity. Then we write the term whose expectation we are finding out. That is this term. Multiply by the PMF of the two parameter Laplace distribution. That is this multiply by 1 divided by 2 lambda. Now we take another variable, let's say z, which is equals to x minus mu divided by lambda. And we know that this z belongs to standard Laplace distribution. Now, from this term, we will get the value of x in terms of z. So that's why we write this value here, we will get this. Again, we know that from this this value is actually equals to z. That's why we write here z. Now, according to these, we will change dx in terms of dz. So now, if we differentiate this both sides with respect to z, we get this. And from this, we get the value of dx in terms of dz. That's why we write this term here like this. After doing cutting, we get all over this value. Uh, yes, one more thing. If we consider it as A and it as B and let's say it as N, then by applying this formula, we will get this term is equals to this term. That's why we get this whole value. Now, again, look that we take submission outside the integration. That is, we write it here. Now, we know that our integration is with respect to z. That means the terms which does not contain z, we can write that terms outside the integration. That means this term lambda raised to power k and this term does not contain z. That's why we can write uh, these terms outside the integration and inside the integration, we write z raised to power k and e raised to power minus modulus z. Now, we can write this integration as like this. Now, in this term, we can do some changes. That is, let's suppose we write z is equal to minus z, right? That means here we get minus z raised to power k. And we can write that as minus 1 raised to power k multiplied by z raised to power k, okay? So, that's why we write here minus 1 raised to power k. Now, again, we write here minus z, that minus we will take outside the integration, that means we write here minus 1. Now, again, if we will change the limits, that is minus infinity will become minus minus plus infinity and 0 will become, all, minus 0 is always equals to 0, okay. And also, by applying this formula, that is by interchanging these limits, that is, if we write infinity here and zero here, we again multiply this whole term with minus. That is, again minus. Minus minus will become plus. So, that's why we write at the place of this term, this value. Now, we know that our z lies between zero to infinity. Again here, zero to infinity. Now, zero to infinity are all the positive terms. That's why we need no modulus here. So, we get overall this value. Now, again, by using the formula of this gamma function, we can write at the place of this gamma k plus 1. And at the place of this, we can write gamma k plus 1. And by taking gamma k plus 1 outside from these two terms, we will get this value. Again, we know that gamma a plus 1 is equal to a factorial. That's why gamma k plus 1 can be written as k factorial. So, this overall is the value of rth moment about region of the two parameter Laplace distribution. Now, by using this relation, we will find out first moment about region, which is called mean of the two parameter Laplace distribution. That is, in this all term, we write at the place of r1. So, we get a mu 1 dash, that is this value. 
now if we expand this submission that is firstly we write in all this term k is equal to 0 we get this value then we write k is equal to 1 in this term plus we get this value now this combination value is 1 it is also 1 it is also mu raised to power 1 right it is also 1 and 1 plus 1 is equals to 2 that means 2 cancel out by 2 we write here only mu raised to power 1 next plus now in this term we look only at here that is 1 minus 1 is 0 that's why this whole term will become 0 so overall the value of our mean is only mu now we will calculate second moment about origin that is the mu 2 dash that means now in this relation at the place of r we write 2 so we will get this term now again on expanding the submission that is firstly in this whole term we write k is equal to 0 we get this plus we write k is equal to 1 we get this plus we write k is equal to 2 we get this and again solving these terms we get this value that is a mu 2 dash now we want to find out the variance which is equal to mu 2 dash minus mu 1 dash square now by placing these term values we get this that means overall variance of the two parameter laplace distribution is 2 lambda square Thanks for watching our video. If you like our video, then please like, share and subscribe our channel. And we have also uploaded some other playlists as TFZ distribution, central limit theorem, chi sky distribution, discrete distributions, continuous distributions. Please check those playlists also. And the videos you request us, we upload them in a different playlist. So you can check that playlist also. Thanks for watching.